All right, today's <clears throat> Sunday, June 9th, 2019. Want to do a little quick video here of my new, my new project. I picked this car up off of eBay. Uh, it was on there for a few weeks, and I'd been watching it, and uh, the price got lower and lower, and finally I called the guy, and we struck a deal. <clears throat> and I went to get this thing. Uh, it was in Oklahoma, uh, about eight hours north. Uh, so we went Friday, and we got back last night. And uh, I mean, obviously it's 61. <clears throat> um, I bought this car. I'm gonna try something a little different. Um, I'm gonna go back with the ermine white, original color. So just give it a little quick walk around here. The hood is exceptionally solid, and it's really straight. It's all original. Uh, fenders are pretty good. Got a little bit of work down there on the bottom needs done. The brow's good on this one. This one has a patch done at some point. Um, and a patch down on the bottom that I'll have to take care of. Uh, it's got coker uh, fat white walls. <clears throat> the doors are really, really solid. Um, it's had a couple of patch jobs on the floor, but overall it's pretty, I think I can make something out of it. Um, doors are really dry. Door jams. The quarters have had some work on the lower quarters, um, but these appear to be a pretty good job. Right, right now, it's, I guess it's an epoxy primer. <clears throat> the guy I got it from said it's been sitting like this for about 16 years. So, trunk is pretty good. Not sandblasting these, for sure. Uh, Looks like they had to cut out a little bit there to get to the box brace. Um, but a little, little hole right there. Trunk gutters are really dry. <coughs> and this is original trunk, and man, it's, it's, it's almost there. It doesn't take much. Um, the roof the same. It's, it won't take much to put paint on that. <coughs> Go around this side here. Like I say, the quarters had, have had work, but they did a pretty good job, so I'm going to just block them down. Spend the next few, several weeks, couple months blocking it down. Door jam good. Looks like they had some rocker work at one point. <clears throat> but the door is really, really good. No rust at all on them. So like I say, it's an original white red interior car. The only thing the car is missing <clears throat> is a back window. So I have the I have windshield, side glass, all the stainless, all the headliner moldings. Uh, I got an original grill, upper grill. I have a new grill, new upper grill. Original three-piece bumpers. It came with original re-chromed one-piece bumpers. I guess they call them California bumpers. That was a buying point for me. <laughs> uh, the car came loaded down. It came with some airbags, tubular suspension, front and rear, uh, disc brakes, wheel wood calipers, which I may or may not use, uh, door panels, rear panels, all the side glass, vents, pretty complete car minus the back window. <clears throat> of course, the interior shot, but uh, at least it's there. That was the main thing. I wanted it to be there. So, <clears throat> excuse me. So I'm going to do, uh, I think I'm going to do white, red interior, red stripe, four wheel disc brake. Powder coat the suspension, tubular. May put an LS motor in it. Um, still debating. I really don't know. Right now, I have a lot more time than I have money after buying this. So I'm just going to take a long time blocking this car down. I'm going to put on the rotisserie, do the same job that we did with the 64. Um, I've never had a 61. So, but I mean, I think it's generally the same car as a 62, and I did have a 62. So uh, let me open this hood here. Like I say, the hood is, is really, really solid. Um, <clears throat> not sandblasting these, no way. Firewall's good, frame is good, rolls, um, that's about all it does. It doesn't have any kind of brakes or anything. So I just wanna do a little quick video. I'm gonna be documenting this whole thing just like I did with the 64. We're still working on the Red Rocket. And actually, we're probably gonna paint that car before I even touch this. So right now, I just have it on the skate so I can move it around. But uh, 
that was this weekend's project and we made it home safe. 16 hour round trip, everything went smooth. Truck pulled good. So you guys stay tuned. Um, gonna be doing the same thing that we did on this one. Sandblast the floor pans, epoxy, powder coat chassis, the whole nine, just like on the 64. In fact, I think I'm gonna call this car the four aces. Kinda like that, kinda grew on me on the way home. So uh, it's a shame because these, these wheels, you can't run disc brakes with these wheels. And I really like the tire, so I'm gonna have to figure something out. But uh, you guys feel free to leave comments or suggestions on what, should, what I should do with this car, but I'm thinking white um, or red. I don't know, we'll see. So you guys, uh, thanks for watching and stay tuned for more updates on this car.